Okay, spring kit came in. Pretty excited about getting this AR <clears throat> up and running. So, so these are the old springs. It's kind of curious these new springs are supposed to be beefier, so they came in a container like that and then the hardware. Oh yeah, those are much, those are a lot more substantial. And I'm just going to kind of snap those down like so. Got to fit those in position for now. That's more or less how those are going to go. Okay, I'm gonna have to bring the plinth back over and uh, let's see about putting this together. Okay, so <clears throat> springs are in. Now, let's see what that is like from the top. It's kind of curious how that's going to feel once we get this platter on. Those springs are definitely very, very, very very tight. Now, these did come with this. So I'm wondering, I may have to remove those other bolts. Because right now, that's not even close to sitting where it's supposed to be sitting. Warm day in the garage. I thought this was going to be a quick one. I may have to save this for another day because it is. Probably the last over 90 degree day of the year, hopefully. This is, uh, was this October? So, yeah, I think those have to come out, so. Whoa, stuff went flying. All right, let me see about getting these pieces out of here. Okay, let's see how well, that is. That should be much better. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's much more like it. At least I'm hoping. Because it is a warm day in here today. And... If this doesn't get it, I may have to come back and... Oh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Perfect. I'm going to have to tweak those springs underneath a little bit, but it's good enough for right now. So, what I'm going to do next is reinstall the tone arm. All 
All right, so let me, uh, that's pretty, it's going to be a pretty, well, not easy, but it should be a pretty simple procedure. Just feed that through, put the bearing back in, and uh, re-solder the tone arm wires back onto the connector. So that's what I'll do.